to connect your document camera to a computer, then you can use the ImageMate software that came with the document camera. Disconnect the USB cable, then you will insert your CD and you will switch from document camera mode to computer mode. So now you're going to be able to see your computer desktop. Install the software. Select the language and click OK. Click Next. Next. And install. And click Finish. Now we can open ImageMate software by clicking on the I am icon. We'll see two windows appear. The top is your menu and the bottom part is the live image from the document camera. Now I can annotate on the live image. I can choose a pen, a straight line, squares, circles. I can choose the thickness and I can choose the color, so I can underline things, I can circle things, and if I want to erase, I'll click on the eraser here, and to erase everything on the screen, I'll press this clear all icon. I can save this image to my computer and then bring this up later to review with my class or import it into a PowerPoint presentation or uh, upload it to the web. And I can make my window full screen. I can zoom in and zoom out. And when I'm zoomed in, I can use this hand here to pan around the image. In the menu, I can open previously saved images and files. Next to that, I can capture an image. So if I press this, the window of the capture image comes up. The live image is still behind it. And again, I can annotate and save. Next to the capture is a video icon. When I press this, my video box comes up. The top portion is for regular video recording. So if I click on Start Recording, I select where I want the video to save to, and then hit Save, it will start recording anything underneath the document camera. Now the bottom portion of this video menu box is for time-lapse photography. And time-lapse photography is for if you're going to record how a chick hatches from its egg or a butterfly emerges from its cocoon. Before you press start recording, you'll want to come over here to this last icon. It's called settings. And down at the bottom, you can choose your interval time. So you can have the document camera take a picture every second, every three seconds, every five seconds, up to 24 hours. You'll press OK. So when you press save, it will start taking a picture at the interval time. And when you're finished and you press stop, it will condense it into a video file and then you can play back that video. So for example, you can see this cloud video that we made earlier. You can see how the clouds move by. You can see how the shadow moves. We just took a picture every minute for a few hours. So next to the video recording icon, we have a live image icon. And this will just bring up the live image, which is what we're looking at now. And next to that is a remote control. So you can control the document camera from your computer screen.